Hey, Reagan Ram here with OrpheusAudioAcademy.com, helping you make better music and grow your fan base online. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can quickly and easily create vocal chops in just seconds with UJAM's new Dynamo. So if you don't know, UJAM is a company that was founded by Farrell Williams and Hans Zimmer, and their mission is to create great sounding and easy to use music tools that enable people to make music faster, better, and easier. And they've definitely done it here with Dynamo. So basically what Dynamo is, basically an instant remix tool. So you can instantly remix any sound, any instrument to create something new and interesting. So this can be used on a lot of different things. They've got stuff for like your whole track. If you want to like remix your whole track, you put this on your mix bus. Um, bass, drums, pads. Uh, here is vocals and of course subtle and also sound effects. So here in this case, I'm going to be using the different vocal chops and showing you how you can create really cool vocal chops in just seconds. Now that is pretty awesome. With just one preset here, we now have vocal chops and those sound pretty darn cool. Um, and you, know, you could even imagine like printing that to audio if you wanted to and then messing around with them further there if you wanted to go more in depth. But um, here's what you got. You got a very simple interface here. First off, pretty awesome. It's got this steampunk plus like fantasy sci-fi aesthetic to it, which is really cool. Definitely my jam, especially as a sci-fi and fantasy author in addition to music producer. Here we got these basic controls here. So you have your finisher knob in the middle. So this is basically your mix knob. So how much of the effect are you using? Although this isn't always a mix knob. Sometimes depending on the preset, it's cycling through different patterns. Um, so it, it will kind of tell you in the notes section here what's going on. Um, and then for this case um you're gonna have like different patterns so you can do um like half time or triplets or double time or or um poly right here um and then you're gonna have like different ways to modulate what's going on the what's going on under the hood basically and so with the vocal chops um i've noticed that typically you're gonna have your your um, very knob these are called very knobs very knob two is going to be bringing in just the straight vocal that you have regularly um, in addition to the chops. So if you pull this all the way down, you hear just the chops, you pull this in up, you get more of the regular, but it's not just normal, um, which is why it's not really a dry mix. You're gonna have an actual processed vocal underneath. And so uh, I'm gonna play this um, and be adjusting the controls so you can hear that. And then um, these, uh, by the way, these these controls, these knobs, basically they, what they do, they change with every preset. Uh, in this case, we have um, reverse, so it can be, can actually add um, the vocal reversed back in. So we're at, like reversed vocal chops and then the tones if you just wanna brighten it or darken it. Um, so uh, so here we go, I'll just, I'll just play this with this in and then adjust the controls and you can kind of see what they're doing. that is pretty cool so I mean you can even imagine doing automation with this maybe you start out with just the vocal chops and then you bring in the vocal over time that um, behind it um, so that's that um, let's listen to what the reverse does So that is pretty cool. So the reverse obviously is reversing the vocal chops. It's really adding some craziness, some, but also very, very interesting sound to the mix. And then of course, we just got the tone here to brighten it or darken it. And so obviously there's a lot of potential here. You can do really some really cool things. 
Um, again, especially with automation, um, this is a section that's kind of building up. So maybe I would start with it darker and maybe just the chops. And then over time I would bring it in. That is really cool. Uh, I'm gonna show you some other presets now that you can kind of see how this works. So let's just cycle through some of these and kind of hear what the different presets will do. Anyway, you can hear that's really cool. There's a whole bunch of more presets I could go through here. We could be here for days, but you can see you can get really awesome, really cool vocal chops in just seconds. And there's a whole bunch of other um, examples here too for if you want to hear it on different things. Um, I actually pulled it up on drums here as well. I've got it here. So if you want to hear this um, on drums now. So this is really cool. I can see myself using the automation here um, with this building up and the vocal chops. I probably have the tone way down, um, probably the rearrange uh, way down. And then I would automate this in as it goes or probably move this up, move the tone up. And so the drums are getting crazier um, and more um, increasing in um, the brightness as well as the vocal chops are doing kind of the same thing to kind of really help this whole section build up and just create this really cool transition out of the bridge into the final course. So um, I can show you a lot more examples, right? We kind of be here all day. Let's see if I can fit one more in. So let's listen to this on the bass now. <laughs> That's pretty cool. That's pretty awesome. <laughs> That's pretty 
Anyway, I need to stop because I could go on all day. There's so many things you can do with this. It still wants to keep going even after I hit stop. Anyway, this is so cool. You can do so many amazing things, really make unique sounds, really add that spice and interest to your track. So if you want to pick this up, just go to orpheusaudioacademy.com slash dynamo and you can get a 30 day free trial. I also have a link to that in the description below. Let me know if you like this, if you think this looks cool and might be something you'll use in your productions. Also, if you want to see my reviews of other awesome UJAM tools and software, then just click on the playlist that should be showing on the screen right now. Otherwise, have an awesome day, keep creating, and I'll see you in a future video. Bye.